Hi guys, Lolly here. Welcome back to another episode of Life is Strange. We are up to part two of episode one and last episode was pretty crazy. We found out we could rewind time. So I'm eager to get this game started again um, and I hope you guys are enjoying it. So I'd like to resume right now. So we just pulled the fire alarm. And now we're outside with um, a class. These graphics are insane. Would Nathan Prescott please come to the front office? Missing Thank person's you. poster. Um, there's some birdies. There's a fountain. Oh, what's this? Can my dad be okay? Okay, we can sit. Let's sit here. All right, we can sit here at the fountain. This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. Oh, look at the birdie. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow, I did rewind time. That is crazy. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find Imagine being able to do that in real life. Oh my goodness. That would be friggin' scary. So, space to get up. Okay. So we just sat there and pondered for a while. Alright, so we need to go to this chick right here. I'm pretty sure. Mrs. Grant, maybe? Let's speak to her and I'm see what's going on. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Sure. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. That's crazy. That's crazy. I get why school should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms. It's a slippery slope, and it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Um, you know a lot. <laughs> you know a lot about Blackwell for being the science teacher. Science is history, Max. And I have a secret wish to teach local lore and legends. There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Yes, yeah, sign it. Why not? Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for <laughs> a good reason. <laughs> That's a good way. Your action will have consequences, okay? Hold on, tab for a journal. What is this? I'll meet you in the lot, looking cool. My camera will be ready to see you shortly, I hope so. What on earth? What's this? Do you want me for a coffee after school? He's cute. Please, make sure you check out the necromantic on my flash drive. Hey, Mad Max, let's bust shit up. Wait, I have to study for a physics test, so if you bust anything, we will also have to measure its velocity. Don't ignore this message. Hi, Max, could you get my flash drive? I need some info. Hello. All right, meet you in the lot. All right. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Where are the dorms? Okay, so there were, I did see... All right, well, we've just opened my journal. Okay, so, do we tap? Next. So this is just all about what happened. All right. So dormitories this way. So let's go to the dorms. We'll follow this path. Exhibition panel. Um, I guess this path goes the same way, so we could have at least gone straight. So dormitories, back this way. Dormitories. Excellent. Press left mouse to go to the dormitories. Okay. 
So we don't just walk there, we actually have to click into it. That's very, that's pretty cool. So dormitories to the right. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Um, excuse me. No. Can you oh, move? Look. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Hi, what a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> yeah. Um, is this not the dorm? Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wow, that's just oh, wait. charming. Hold that pose. Yes. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Wow. Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Um, ladder? Look at the ladder? I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. What's I that? just want Hate. to get Victoria the hell out of the way. How can we get Victoria out of the way? Alright, let's look around. Do we have any props? Sprinkler. Yeah. Look at the sprinkler? Okay, now where exactly is the sprinkler Ooh, valve? Ooh, sprinkler valve! We can just wet her. Where is the sprinkler valve? Is there a sprinkler valve around here? Oh gosh. Please have sex. Okay. Charming. All right, let's find this sprinkler valve. Uh, maybe this way. Hi. Go back up there. There has to be a valve around here somewhere. Or maybe not. Ooh, what can we use with that? What can we do with that? Okay, that just sort of happened and then stopped. Okay. We need to find a sprinkler valve. Is this like the PowerPoint here? Could it be in this building? In here? Let's have a look. Ooh, look at this. Yes, we want to look. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. Okay, so let's use it. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. Well, how are we going to use it? Water pump. Think, Max. Rewind and find something. Oh, so we need to get the paint or something. Okay. Samuel. There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. Okay. Oh my gosh. What it's got something to do with this paint. No, we don't want to look at that. We want to tamper with that. I wanted to do that in the first place. Okay, let's see if this works. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Sam. Okay, let's see if this works. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. I wonder what's going to happen. Poor Samuel. Is anything going to happen with this? I don't know why we can't just like walk around <laughs> There we go. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right Jesus under the Christ. bucket. What the hell? Okay. So we must need to tamper with the... Do we tamper with that? Hmm. A paint bucket next to Victoria. Do we see rewind enough? Do we rewind enough? Yes, we need to tamper with that. And then, okay, so we've tampered okay, with that. let's see if this works. And then we'll go to over here and see if we can do something with this. Use, okay, let's do that. What the hell? Are you kidding? 
Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah. Ooh, we water got on my on her head. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Let's see if this works. Oh, no, the paint bucket's going up. Oh, my plan is finally coming into place. Break, 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 break. Yes. No fucking you okay, way. Victoria? Yes. Oh, sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Oh, dude. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Woohoo! Now we can get past! Do we say anything to her? Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Mm -hmm. Comfort? I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there will be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. Okay, so we've kind of made friends with her. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. <laughs> nice. Can we go in now? And get the flash drive? You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? Okay. I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Oh, okay. So making friends with her was the right move. See? Positively, guys. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her, but we took the nicer route. Okay. Red rum. What's red rum? Okay. Courtney. Taylor is a slave. Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. Juliet, read this week's edition of the Blackwell Top. Seriously, who cares? Okay. So what do we know? How do we know which one our door? Oh gosh, there's toilet paper, there's a fire alarm. Um, Max's room, over here. All right, so we can go in here. No one's written on her slate. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. We're gonna enter. Let's enter her dorm room. Alright, so home. flash drive. My favorite cocoon. Bed, cushion, teddy bear, drawer, high five, photo album, sticky note, plant, book. Where's this flash drive? Oh god. Happy birthday. We don't believe it's been 18 whole years since you were brought to us. Max, your principal sent me an email saying that you told some tales about a Blackwell honor student. Is this true? The principal said it was a seriously false charge and he's worried you're telling Stormy. Oh my God. So he thinks it's a lie. My goodness. All right. So we need to note. What's the note? Let's have a look at this note. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. This is contents, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so where's the flash drive? Where's the flash drive? Power strip, look. The Max Caulfield photo memorial wall. Okay, it has a really big circle around it, so look at the teddy bear. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. Okay, we need, let's when open I the drawer. Your eye. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The okay, longer I wait, books. the worse it'll be. Okay, so I Idiot. guess they've had a falling out. So here's what? my go-to source for instant photo inspiration. No, laptop, laptop. There we go. Look, there's a flash there's drive in there. Laptop begging me to check in. Um, use it. I am so addicted to this site. Camera porn. Porn makes me laugh. It's Thanks nice to feel like I already made a real friend process. here. I shall never stop sending you messages of gratitude. I also have a rather an, to a TV cult classic films on a flash drive. If you ever want to check them out? Okay. All right. So done. Let's look at that. 
Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. I've already drive so I can watch some flicks while I study. If you need it back, just track me down in my room. So we need to go to D. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. All right, so we're going to Dana's room. Let's go and have a look for Dana and see which room she's in. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Okay. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Let me out, Juliet. This is so stupid. Answer, you wuss. Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. You are ridiculous. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. Ooh. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even you asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Um, how are we meant to know that? Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew Wow, we just all. fluked that. Of course I do. <laughs> just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. So, how did you find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, nice. I swear I didn't do anything. I should find a way to end this silly standoff. How do we do how do we do this? Answer you what? Dana's still a cheerleader at heart. How do we um Um how can we how can we I should find a way to end this silly standoff. Well how do we do it? I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. Um okay. So how do we end this? How do we end this? Um do I have to rewind anything? Why are we rewinding? Oh, we can rewind before the actual chat started? Or not? Hey, Juliet. Is stupid. Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dan. She's your friend. She's your friend. Friends don't sex with their best friend's boyfriend. No, probably not. You're ridiculous. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Juliet Watson. Juliet Watson. I'm flattered. I didn't... Of course I do. Just because... According to Victor... According to Victor... She saw the sex. Max, I swear... Alright, so obviously we don't need to... No boys allowed, oh my goodness. Do we need to go? No need to go there now. Okay. I thought that's where we came in. I guess not. So how are we going to end this? Do we need to talk to this Victoria? Board. Okay, nothing in there. Oh my goodness. Fire alarm? At least that's an alarm from this century. Or not. We can look at toilet paper. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. Okay. Victoria, we need to talk to her. Okay. Or not. What are we looking for exactly? Clothes, shoes, the gazette, gallery, camera. Ooh, there's a camera there. Let's look at the camera. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime... Use a tablet? Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Maybe I'll Maybe join I her posse. Maybe I will join her posse. Wow. Okay. So what else can we see? Jewelry. What are we looking at? What's this? Yes, I get it. Enter, Enter the, the vortex. vortex Club. Laptop? No. Use a laptop. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. Boom. This is the email I need to show you. There we Juliet. go. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Okay, so we need to print it. We need to use the printer. Where's the printer? Where's the printer? Print email. There we go. And let's get out of here. Let's get it. I bet Victoria no, put Juliet on money. her shit list. No, come on, article. come on, come on, come on, take. Let's take Just that. better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. There we go. Cool. 
So let's go leave. We need to leave. Okay, and we need to go down to Dana now. Let's go down here and show her the email. Let's see if we can do this. Email. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. She's got really bloodshot eyes. So. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Flash drive, please. We're still gonna be this Warren guy in the lot. Almost. Oh, so we have to get it. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Okay, so let's take this flash drive. Oh gosh, here we go. What does Warren want now? The more I text, the longer I take on my way. So, okay, so we need to go to the parking lot. Let's get out of here with the flash drive. Oh my gosh, let's do this! This is a really great game, guys. I'm sorry if I'm not talking too much. I'm just really into it. Um, let's go back this way, because this was the parking lot. Fuck this shit! Okay, it's not letting me go this way. Damn, I better rewind. Why? Why am I rewinding? Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. Why am I rewinding? Why do I have to rewind? What did I miss? I have no idea. Okay. This is the way I went. Fuck this shit. Oh, I was supposed to stop that from happening. Okay. I need to warn her. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. There we go. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Well, there you go. Okay, so do we have to speak to her now? Let's see if she's Max, okay. that was awesome. Thank you. She has really cool hair. I like her hair. No problem. You have quick reflexes. Years of mad dodging skills. Bullies never change. That's why you're better off. You're smart. We should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid book. Okay, so we're we going to the parking lot now. Um, main build. Oh gosh, here we go. Victoria sent me a message. By the way, thanks, but we're not friends. Okay, do I. Can I reply? <laughs> I guess not. So she has my number, which is really strange, so... So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, this guy and thinks, leave me alone. I think he thinks he's the shit. Take a photo. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. What is up with that guy? Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. Sis. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and Dave. So, do we rewind that now? Oh my god, this so is so confusing sometimes. I could rewind and try something different. Okay, so we gotta intervene this time. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. So we've just caused more problems for ourselves now. I should have just stuck with the photo. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. Okay, so... I felt like an everyday hero.
I really like the music in this game. I have to give them props for that, that's for sure. Okay, so we still got the USB. We're just wandering through the Blackwell campus. 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 Alright. We've gotten to the car park. Now we gotta meet Warren, who has been very anxiously texting me for like how long now? I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. Hi, Warren! Hey, Max, check it out. Give me the what flash up, drive. How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. No problem. So this guy must be hung up on Max. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. I don't want to talk about it. I don't it. want to talk about it. Jeez, you're a little miss sensitive today. I wouldn't push your luck, Warren. Not in the mood today. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? No, I've been way too busy with class and life. Damn, girl, you had it like a year. <laughs> or a week. I did browse through all the titles, Drama Queen. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Ew. No fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. <laughs> I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. Not at all. Not at all. Sensitive is good, unless you're a pushover. You have hip taste and a quick mind. Thanks for noticing, Max. The right girl will too. If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. So this guy is really hung up on her. Do we want to talk about it? I need it? to talk to somebody. Just to get it out of my system. Can Dr. we trust Warren this guy, though? In the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. For reals, Warren. This is between you and me. Not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? Who is this guy? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? <sighs> I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal, now. Otherwise he's gonna shoot him? Answer me, let's just, let's What just... are you talking about? I know you're new here, but don't even play stupid with me. I'm not new. I've lived here for years. Then you should know the Prescotts own this shithole. Then you don't have to worry about me. Worry about yourself. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Take a step back! Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! <gasps> Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore right in the now. bathroom! <gasps> Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Warren. Go! Go! I got this! <gasps> Yay, Holy Max. moly! Get your this is just like rest! Don't even try to run! Nobody messes with me! Nobody! There's and we no just left Warren out. there by himself. This is just so full on already. Man. Holy moly. Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? I have no idea. I have no idea. I know he's a Prescott. And an asshole. 
Your friend really stood up for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt, and you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? No, it felt like a real city for artists. Big and bright. Great for taking pictures. Yeah, must be hard coming back to a hick town like Arcadia again. Not after seeing you. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Him? Is that his, that's Only her, that's her teacher. He was a pretty famous photographer in the 90s. I've always loved his work. Those that can't do, teach. I'm glad you found a good reason to come back. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Gosh! I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Wow. What a pretty photo opportunity. Take a photo. Told ya. Broken. Oh, man, are you serious? Oh, no. Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it at my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Nerd alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. <laughs> Welcome home, Max. Wow. Alright guys, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you so much for tuning in. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this game as much as I am right now. So, until next episode guys, take care.